What's up? What? Say hi to the vlog. What? Say hi to the vlog. Hi vlog. <laughs> I'm doing a rant right now. <laughs> Why? About YouTube and their my losing subscribers and views. I'm gaining subscribers. I have more subscribers than you now. Did you see my video? Hang on a second. <laughs> Did you see this it? This is not acceptable. I have 88 subscribers. 88? I've added 88 subscribers to your shopping list. What the heck? I'm not buying subscribers. Oh my god. Alexa, Alexa, cancel. Alexa, cancel. I'm not buying 88 more subscribers. How'd you get those? I'm recording this. No. Oh my god. And I buy subscribers. <laughs> what? So did you buy all your subscribers? No, I don't buy my subscribers. I'm cutting this out. We're gonna edit that out. No, keep it in. No, Alexa, cancel my order. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, right. To cancel or manage your Amazon order, please visit Amazon. I can't even cancel it now. Are you kidding me? I can't cancel my idiots. Yeah, no, you're 83. So oh wait, no, you are at 88 subscribers. How you, you made a video and it had Tanner Fox and Rice come in the title. No, I had more before that. I had 80 something before that. Well, that's, I, I wouldn't gain 40 subscribers just from that one video. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to make nine, nine different accounts. Yeah. Like I, <laughs> I guess I'm gonna have to make nine different accounts. <laughs> yeah. I gotta go. Alright, bye. Yeah. Alright, guys, let's start the day. Okay, what's up guys? Today's gonna be a different video. I always say that, I feel like, but it's true today. So, I'm gonna kind of rant today about YouTube, YouTube's policies, YouTube's... just YouTube in general, actually. Um, I know that I'm in no position to really argue with YouTube, uh, just because I have been gaining subscribers and I have been gaining more views and more likes on my videos. That's all well and good, but there are some things that we need to talk about. Um, now I'm not here to complain, I'm not here to be like, oh, but I'm um, poor me, I'm not making money, and I'm, I'm still making money. I'm still doing stuff. And it's not, like, there's other YouTubers out there that they make videos just for the money, and that's it. Unfortunately, those YouTubers are losing money, um, they are losing subscribers, losing views, losing the ad revenue that they get, um... That's what we're going to talk about. So, me, specifically, I have seen this in my videos. So, before I started doing daily vlogging, I was doing one video a week to one video a month. I was doing not very good. Um, so, we can look back at, like, the early, early, early videos of last year, which was about nine months ago, I guess. Eight months ago. So... Okay, so what we're going to start off with is saying, I used to do bi-weekly videos. So bi-weekly videos, I would do one, like, two to three videos a week, probably. Um, which worked out pretty well for two months. Um, I was enjoying it. I was getting enough views where I was doing pretty well off. Um, I was doing pretty well off with my likes and through dislike ratio. But recently, within the past, I want to say, two months since I did the tattoo video, that's probably my most watched video since last year. Um, that's kind of crazy, but that's the truth now. I know that I'm in no position to argue with YouTube because of my the way that my channel's been growing and whatever, but I want to bring up the point of, I want to say, it was this video, it was the day my Instagram, my Instagram got deleted, not clickbait, must watch video. That video was my most watched video. Up until the week after that, when YouTube decided to take out all my views, all my likes, all my dislikes, 
and start off from scratch. That's crazy. Like, my video, it wasn't clickbait. It said it wasn't clickbait. It, there was no way that it was um, copyrighted. There was just, it was, I have no idea why this happened, but it did. So, this video came out on June 10th, 2017. Um, the video gained about 100 views in the past, like, three days. I remember watching it go up. In the past three days, it got, like, 120 views, something like that. Something crazy like that. I even put it on Snapchat. I wish I saved the Snapchat, but I put it on Snapchat. I'm like, oh my god, this is crazy. That Why is this getting so many views? It's amazing. I believe that it was a glitch in the system. Um, because there's also been... Other YouTubers, bigger YouTubers that have had this glitch where they got either massive amount of subscribers or they lost like a ton of subscribers. And I'm not saying that my video, my channel's being hacked or anything, but it, I'm pretty sure that it's YouTube's fault. Um, the, the problem I'm having is that way back when, way, 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 way back when, when I first started making YouTube videos, this, I started making YouTube videos just like music compilation things with my GoPro when I was like 12 years old. I started this channel, NP Nilto Productions, three years ago. I started this in the summer of 2014, and I've never stopped making YouTube videos. Um, since then, this is my most watched video of all time. This video, um, I'll link that in the description. This video that I'm looking at right now, Summer Pool video, I'll link that in the description. Go watch it. It's really well done. I remember doing this my first all by myself edited video, and I was so, so, so proud of this. And it got, it's, it has about 600 views. That's a great start to a a first time YouTuber thing. That's amazing. The, what you're going to notice when you start making videos is that you're going to make these videos and if you make more content more frequently, you're going to get less views than if you upload monthly. When you upload monthly, people have a time to look over your video a couple times, get the feel until you make a new video. If you upload every day, like I'm doing right now, I know that I'm going to have less less views on my video. I already know that. That's a given. Um, my videos have been cut in half, basically, as someone saw I was doing monthly or weekly videos. That's okay. I'm not saying that this is horrible and I'm, like, depressed or anything about this. I still love making YouTube videos. So, this channel, Nova Productions, we had the, the views... We post, I haven't posted in eight months, um, on this channel, just because I haven't really had the, the, I didn't really want to, I don't want to say that, I didn't really want to, but I just didn't have, like, the motivation enough, plus this channel only has, like, six subscribers, like, there's, it's not a big growing channel like my channel is now, um, DPKA videos, our group channel, link in the description below, has 20 something subscribers, still not, hasn't been growing in the past year. We make videos every few months, I'm gonna say every three months, um, every four months, sorry. So we make videos about three times a year, and they do pretty well, um, but recently the views, as they always have been, They've been going down. Um, with my current channel that I'm on right now, um, go subscribe if you're not subscribed already. Plug, always plug. Yeah. Okay, so, here we go. Okay, so this is what I want to get into now. I'm going to let you guys get up until this point. So, I'm going to say that, okay, so, my Instagram got deleted. Okay, so, this video has 31 views. As you can see, okay, going back to what I was saying before with monthly view, monthly videos, those have like 74 views, um, 83 views, 125, 58, that's 32, that's kind of low. These are more daily vlogs here. Um, 64, 68, 60, um, let's see, 88 views, okay. So, just those alone, 
have are double the amount of the views I'm getting as a daily vlogger. Um, that's just how YouTube works. I don't, there's nothing you can do about that. That's just how YouTube works. That's how YouTube makes their ad money. That how, that's how it just works. Views and subscribers pay for YouTube. They're really not for the people anymore. They're really not for the channel themselves. They're more for the company of YouTube. And if you're not working for YouTube, you're you're not gonna you're not gonna see any of the, that money. You're never gonna see that money ever, um, unless you have connections and have massive amount of subscribers. You're never gonna see those. It says on this one website I was looking at a couple days ago, it was like, oh yeah, he makes thirty to tw uh, twenty to thirty dollars a month off YouTube. And I'm just like, I've never seen the check. I've never seen any of this. Like, I don't know where you're getting their source, your sources from. I've never seen a dime from YouTube. That's just because my views are so low that it only pays for YouTube. It doesn't pay for anybody else but YouTube. The thing, the reason why these views go down, I'm just going to blatantly put this out, is because YouTube takes away so many views, you might get... 50 views. You might get 50 views, but those views do not go to you. They go up, up into the cloud, wherever they are, and go down to YouTube and pay for them. Now, also, you guys are going to notice when you make daily vlogs, your views are going to be going up and down, up and down, up and down. So just for the past week, I had a 30, 25, 29, 45, 26, 17, and 34. Um... Those go up and down so much that you can't really gauge what your revenue is going to be or what your views are going to be like and your like to dislike ratio is going to be. Just because your videos, if they're as different as mine are, they're going to attract a different audience every single time. Um, that's why you need diversity in your videos and your titles and your everything. You just need diversity. That gets you more views. That gets you more followers, subscribers, whatever you want to call them. Um, when you have a video up and you don't post for a few weeks at a time, that video is the only video you will see that's a recent video on your channel. Everybody else is going to see that too. No matter what, everybody else is going to see that one video and they're going to be like, well, this looks interesting. You have to make it look interesting. That's the thing. You have to make it look very interesting. Otherwise, nobody's going to click on it. My first videos, I don't know why. I have no idea, I'm still confused why people clicked on that video. It was a blank, it was like a blank picture of just me staring at something in a garage. Nothing else, yet it has about a hundred views now. Why? I couldn't tell you for the life of me. I don't, I don't know why it's like that, but it just is. Um, when you don't post for months and months and months at a time, or weeks and weeks and weeks, you, your video, that one video is going to be the only thing that your subscribers are going to see on recent. So that's going to be the one they click on the most. Because people, people on the internet don't have time to like go through every one of your videos and just click on every single one that looks interesting or not. Nobody has time to watch a, a 50 minute video or a 30 minute video or even a 20 minute video for that matter. Nobody has time to go watch your entire video. Like that's just not something that you do. Um, so people will look at your video, maybe watch like the first five, ten minutes most at that, uh, and watch that, and that's it. That's why my videos are like eight minutes, ten minutes max, basically. I mean, they might go over sometimes, there might be some things where they go over. I know that recently I did a video, um, the, the car crash video was 16 minutes long. That has more views because that had a more clickbaity title, and that made what people want to click on that more. That makes sense. Um, there are there's things that you're gonna see on YouTube where you're gonna have a jump in subscribers and a jump in views for like three days probably. It's gonna go up like a massive amount, but then over time you'll see it slowly decrease. 
that's YouTube saying, wow, congratulations, you have boosted your inventory, you have boosted your subscribers, you have a bigger fan base, congratulations, we're going to give you all these views. We're going to give you all these things to make you want to do more. But then when you notice that they're... They, then when they notice that you're doing a lot more and they notice that you're taking advantage of their system, all those views that they give you are going to deteriorate and they're going to go away. That happens to subscribers too. My subscribers have been going up and down again. Like, I know that I've hit 80 subscribers as of Thursday of last year, or last week. Thursday of last week, and um, it's been going up and down. Like, it's gone up 5 down three, up two more. Like, this morning I had 83 subscribers. I have 88 subscribers now. I don't know how. I'm going to refresh my channel right now just to see if it changed. Nope, it hasn't changed. Okay, so we're at a down period now. Okay, so these, I'm just letting you know this because this is something that every YouTuber, if you haven't noticed it now, you're going to notice it in the future. I'm not saying that I'm not making money off these videos. I'm not saying that I'm losing subscribers and I'm like depressed or anything. I'm just letting you guys know this is how YouTube works. If you want to become a YouTuber and you want to start doing daily vlogs, if you want to make daily videos, whatever you want to do, this is what you're going to have to deal with. Because this is what it takes to make good content. It makes You make good content, clickbaity titles. I'm not saying go on clickbait. Uh, make titles that are interesting, make them bold letters, make them, if they're like sad, make them like lowercase, parentheses, everything. Um, thumbnails. Thumbnails are so important, I can't stress that enough. Thumbnails, if you don't have a good thumbnail, don't, don't post a video then. There's no reason, nobody's gonna watch your video just because you say, I got a new dog, and... Nobody's going to watch a video about that unless you have, like, a picture of a dog flying off a roof or you're doing something crazy with the dog. Nobody's going to click on that unless you have a good thumbnail. If you have a thumbnail of just you in the car with the dog in the back seat, that's not going to get you the views unless you have either a good title or a good thumbnail. Without those, you're basically screwed. And that's why YouTube is so harsh in the way that they make their money and the way that they make... Um, your views go up and down like that. They basically play with you, and they... It's just hard to watch. Um, it's just hard to be supportive and be happy about getting your subscribers when you... when it changes so frequently. And I think that... I think every YouTuber, if you haven't noticed it now, you're going to notice it sooner or later, that your views are going to be going down, your views are be going up, you're going to have days where it's like, congratulations, like, so some subscribers... Some YouTubers, let's say, some YouTubers that have millions and millions of subscribers, you're going to watch their channel. If you can look up their channel and how much they're going up and down, you can watch that there are days, there are times of the um, of the day where people watch you do the most. That's more of like the mid-evening, uh, the mid-afternoon, like early evening type time. That's the time that the sun's up in like, every part of the world basically. So pretty much every part of the world is like awake at that time. That's what gives you the most views. Unfortunately, I'm not smart enough to do that all the time because I have, I'm busy during the evening and whatever. So I post my videos in the afternoon. Um, those are the times. I'm gonna say if you're like, if you're on the, on the west coast, let's just say near the west coast, like three o'clock, between three o'clock and six o'clock Pacific Standard Time, you're going to basically be, that's the best time you're going to have to make a video. You're going to get a ton of views, you're going to get all those just in that time period because everyone's awake. Everyone's awake, everybody's on YouTube in the morning, most people are on YouTube in the morning, like I said everybody is, but most people are on YouTube in the morning, and that brings in the, the, uh, the views. So, going back to the the way that YouTube makes their money. YouTube loves to support you and to make you um, want to run a business out of this. They encourage the fact that you want to make a business. That's what their whole point is. They're saying, you know, if you subscribe to this pe these people, have them follow you on social media, make these 
images, um, these uh, thumbnails, make these videos, and just post them daily, and it's just, you're gonna get all these subscribers and all these views. They encourage the fact that you have to stay up late at night and make videos the best they can be. And they don't have to be good. They don't have to be good. As long as you have a thumbnail and a title that, like, intrigues people, you have a banger video. Like, you have, like, the best video possible. You, it could be you sitting in a room eating chips for, like, a 30 minute, 30 minutes, basically. You, if you have a thumbnail saying, um, fidget spinner versus, uh, thousand degree knife, whatever, something really basic like that, but people are interested in basic, I don't know, I don't get it, people are basic, are interested in basic things, um, if you have, if you're just like sitting there, eating a bag of chips, but as long as you have a good thumbnail, and a good title, you have, you're gonna have like, 50 views plus, if you're post every day. That's just something that how that's just how YouTube works. I don't get it. A lot of people don't get it. I hope you guys understand what I'm trying to say here. Um, it's just there's so many different little things that go into making a video and making your channel grow. I think the hardest part about this is that YouTube encourages the fact that you have to stay up late at night making videos, making content, trying to find things you can do. They encourage the fact that you get, like, less sleep at night just to make a good video. They want you to, like, really work hard at it. I'm not complaining that I don't... I stay up late sometimes making my videos. I'm I'm glad I'm making YouTube videos. I'm happy to make YouTube videos. That's for me. Now, if YouTube messes up with me and messes up with my views and my subscribers, I'm not going to deal with it because I'm going to take down that video then. Because if YouTube's going to monetize monetize my stuff and use it for their profit, I'm not going to put it on YouTube then. I'm doing it for myself and for my subscribers, not for anybody else. I'm not doing it to make a business out of it. I'm doing it for myself, for my entertainment, and for your entertainment. Um, if YouTube wants to take my views and use them for something else and say, oh, we have the best whatever... I'm not going to be a part of that. I don't want to be a part of the whole YouTube um, company type thing. I don't want to get involved in all that because that's just that's just going to put me in a bad position where I'm going to be losing, I'm going to be gaining a bunch of subscribers and followers and whatever and views and I'm going to just lose it one day. I'm just going to like, I'm going to go from like 3,000 subscribers down to like 50 and it's just, that's how it's going to work and that's why I don't want to be part of that whole YouTube um, scene. I don't want to be a whole part of that YouTube, um, I don't want YouTube to make money off my videos, I don't want that. But that's what happens. That's what's gonna happen, you're gonna see that all the time. Your videos may or may not be monetized, may or may not be age-restricted, whatever. If that happens, that means YouTube has really cracked down on their services and really wanted to, like, make sure that they have the right, um, they have the right, um, uh, what would you call that? Um, they have the right fan base, basically, the demographic. Um, if that ever happens to me, I had a video that was, oh, I want to say it was a long time ago. It was six months ago. You guys will not see this on my channel. This is a private video I had on there. I had, we need to talk about the way my channel is being run. Um, YouTube decided that it was their obligation to monetize my video and age restrict it for no reason. So that means that people that were under the age of 18 couldn't watch it. That didn't make sense. That doesn't make sense to me because this video had nothing inappropriate on it. There was nothing that was wrong. It was me talking to my computer basically saying how I wanted my channel to be run. That doesn't, there's no other reason why this should have happened. I took it down and I privated it because I don't want YouTube to take a profit off my videos without my permission. Like if YouTube wants to like, they're gonna at least what they do, and I've had this happen to me before, where I've had a content on there that was kind of, there was, um, how would, um, there was the content that I had on my channel 
that was copyrighted. And YouTube has no, they don't have a problem with coming to you, emailing you, saying you have this issue, fix it. I have no issue going back to them saying stop using my videos for your gain and I'm gonna get all my videos unmonetized and make nothing off those videos. I have no problem going to them and saying no. Because I don't want to be part of that. I don't want to be part of anything that has to be done with money. I don't want to deal with that. I want to make my own money. I want to make my own way. I want to make my content. I'm not going to deal with anybody else telling me how I run my content. YouTube has these rules. If you don't follow those rules, you're not going to be part of YouTube. I, for one, follow the rules because I want to make my videos. I want to make my videos. I want to put them out for you guys to see them. Not for any other reason. That's the only reason why I want to go and want to make videos daily for you guys. Nothing else. So, that's just my rant for the day. I'm going to cut this down a lot. This is about a 40 minute clip of me just talking. And I feel really bad that I've been kind of like putting this off. Because I've been wanting to talk about this for a while. And I felt like today I had nothing else to do. And this was the content I wanted to make. So, thank you guys so much for watching. I hope you understand what I'm saying. Um... If you guys see any of my videos kind of disappear after a while, that's because of this. Uh, but I just want to get that out because there's going to be a time where you're going to have you're going to see a video one day, and then the next day or the two days later, it's going to be privated because I don't want to deal with YouTube stuff sometimes, and that's just what's going to happen. And yeah, so guys, thank you so much for watching. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you tomorrow. As always, guys, peace out. Someone dissed me, I don't know I'm like who Said I cashed out from that last song, it's true And yeah, I just spent your whole rent on some shoes I hit the club and I'm leaving with two Verified cause all these checks that I blew Your girl on the track, she sound better than you Someone dissed me, I don't know